big Back to the Future fan. Biff is one of my favorite villains of all As time. As well he should be. <laughs> <laughs> my question's uh, for Christopher. Christopher, um, believe it or not, as much as I love Doc Brown, like, you were one of, you played two bad guys, my favorite bad guys of all time, which is the, the bad guy and uh, Roger Rabbit. Um, and, uh, <laughs> And then my, one of my favorite bad guys was psychologically imprinted in my head as a kid, uh, the bad guy Dennis the Menace. Yeah, so that, that role, that role is stuck in my head, that image, and as many different times as I've seen you, that image is stuck in my head. So I want to get your thoughts and your feelings on those two roles. Oh, uh, what was the first one? The first one was Roger Rabbit. Roger Rabbit, Roger Rabbit. Well, there was a uh, comic strip of the two crows, and they, they are like uh, detectives, and they keep falling each other, and getting screwed up. Uh, uh, Mad Magazine, Spy versus Spy? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> two crows. <laughs> two crows. And they, it's kind of the way, you know, the the way the hat was, it wasn't a beak, but I, I felt like that with that black thing on. Um, and I loved it because it, it made me feel like I was supposed to look <laughs> the other way around, whatever. So that was cool. And on the... Um, Dennis the Menace. Dennis the Menace. Uh, I got into that, but I, I have a scene where uh, I'm going through this back alley, you know, where the garbage trucks go in the middle of a pretty high-end neighborhood. And um, there's a boy sitting on the other side of the fence on his private property who's he, he got an apple. And I come up, I lean over, and I take a big knife, and I oh, stab man. the apple, and I take it. That boy, for the rest of the run, could not look at me. <laughs> I, I'd be out of, out of makeup, out of costume, walking, and he'd be walking up with his mom, and he would completely shrink. <laughs> never got over it. He never got over it. And I don't care. 